welcome to manga phase ongoing or welcome back if you've seen my previous videos today i'm going to be building a new bookshelf and moving around my manga it is staying in the same kind of order i have it in but i'm gonna move my bookcases all so that they're together so first up i'm taking off all of the manga and all of the figures that I have off my one shelf in my living room and I'm moving that into my bedroom and now you get to see me putting together a bookcase at like three in the morning I think it was and also the moment I realized I have an electric screwdriver and then the moment I realized I was one battery short of having it working so that was pretty upsetting you also have a fun cameo from my cat Salem because he made himself a little nest in my manga I also had my entire place just shrouded in manga. There was manga on my bed, on my couch, all over my floors. It was horrible, but I finally got all four bookcases in my room next to each other. And so I'm just putting everything up now and getting it all together. I've pretty much kept it in the same order that I had it in before. It's just about having these four kind of flow better. So I'm pretty happy with how this turned out and I hope you enjoy uh, my fun sped up version of me running around. Also, side note, a great little hack that I've used is using a sock to clean my shelves. I use it to dust them. It just picks up the dirt really well. I usually use like an old sock or one of the fun socks that is lost its pair to my dryer at some point in time. So if you're looking for a quick and easy way to clean your shelves, just literally stick a sock on your hand and wipe them down. I promise you it's like my favorite hack that I've learned. So after I finished putting all of the manga together, I started putting my figures up and I was putting up one of my Deku figures when I realized, very shockingly, that it actually has a stand. It has a little hole in its foot and to say the least, I was quite shocked if you couldn't tell from that face. Uh, the problem is that the stand that goes with him is very obviously still in the box which in case you were wondering, is one of the risers currently on that shelf. So I still have not grabbed his little stand, but I did figure out how to get him to like stay up. It makes sense now though, because he's so unstable and falls over all the time that I thought he was just poorly made. Turns out he's not poorly made. I'm an idiot, which is not actually shocking in the slightest, if you know me. 
I wanted to make my bookcase as pretty and just nice to look at as possible. So I tried using all of these little fake vines that I have to cover um, the kind of front parts of the shelves uh, to the best of my ability. So hopefully this will like not end up like falling off within two days. Though I don't exactly have high hopes because I did use tape to keep them up, but fingers crossed. And this is the final product. I have my four large bookcases all next to each other. That's the most I could fit on this wall. So my fifth tall bookcase is actually in its own little corner in my room still, not too far from them. And this houses all of my larger sized manga.